Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be attempting to do some low lights on my slightly brassy kind of blocky blonde hair. I'll let you into a secret which is I already tried to film a low light video and I feel like it went really well until I realised that the dark blonde hair dye that I used like literally did nothing to my hair. Like it might have done a very slight little bit of blending but yeah I think at the end of the video I'd sort of like kidded myself that it looked way better and then I looked back at the <laughs> start footage and I was like oh, there's like basically no difference. Um, so to rectify that situation I've got some light brown which should hopefully have a bit more of an effect. Um, maybe I've now got the technique down from my failed attempt, so silver lining. I plan to start by just going over my roots, um, which are already showing my natural colour, um, but I just want to blend everything and just like add some darkness underneath. Um, I think I want to focus some of the darkness on the underneath sections because that's what looks more natural. I might try and do the low lights just sort of leaving out the ends to keep like brightness but I think I just need to see how that goes. I guess I might be trying to create like a bit of a reverse balayage which definitely sounds out of my ability <laughs> so I just need to mix it and leave it on for half an hour and wash it off so yes and I will be using foils um, which have these nice rip off, oh, rip off <laughs> things so that should help me out a little bit and I've also got this highlight sectioning comb which if you haven't seen one before instead of sectioning with a comb end you just take the piece of hair in here and it sort of sections it for you into these two different sections. So you've then got, you know, two different sections and it's just a lot quicker and easier for someone who isn't professional. Mm. This smells good and it's like a very white, <laughs> creamy colour like for a brown hair dye so that's interesting and yeah it smells really nice Okay, my roots are done. I can see they're already darkening up. A little bit scary because I really want to stay quite blonde, but there can be no light without the dark, as Harry Potter knows. Um, so I'm going to start with the underneath layers. Oh, also, when I was doing my roots, I mean, you can see I was, like, not doing it very carefully. Um... And I was just using my fingers to sort of like blend it out in the hope that it's not like too much of a harsh line. 
I might end up with some like dark spots, likely, but yeah. Less section. Let's keep going. <laughs> Okay, I wasn't really sure where I was going with these bottom layers, but what I ended up doing was putting it all over the roots and blending it down. The bottom layer particularly, like the very bottom layer, I completely saturated that and blended that all the way down to the bottom. The layer slightly above that, I didn't blend it down to the bottom and I left quite a lot out at the bottom. So there should be a lot more blonde. Now for this next section up, I'm starting to properly use sections and I'm splitting the hair into two and I'm leaving the blonde part underneath and then I'm taking the section above from the root and blending it part way down the hair. My plan was to use slightly chunkier sections at the bottom because I wanted to keep the darkness in the underneath because that's how natural hair looks. Oh god, I'm explaining this so carefully, um, but it's kind of ridiculous with the shit show that's about to occur, but I started off with the best of intentions and there was thought behind it originally, but it, it descends, so be prepared. Okay, I feel like everyone's gonna yell at me, but I don't think I'm gonna use foils because it took me so long last time. Um, I hope Brad one day doesn't watch this. I doubt he will. Um, <clears throat> he did say he'd be watching me, but I'm gonna assume that was an empty threat. It's just gonna be quicker and better if I don't, so when, when I have a fabulous result, just... Enjoy. <laughs> it's bad, I was like so much more careful the first time I did this, but now I'm like over it because I literally just did this process um, and I think I've used up my patience. So, <laughs> oops. I mean, I really wanted to do a good job. And then I ran out of energy. Don't hate me. I think that section is too big. I'm gonna go again. Do I? Hang on, no. No, I'm gonna keep it because I want it to be darker near the bottom. And I'll do smaller sections towards the top. Like a little bit out the front.
Girl, <laughs> I am moving so fast here. As I start this new section, I'm starting to leave more of the blonde out and try and blend it down the best I can. But yeah, I am just speeding through this process. <laughs> Too fast, some might say. This does it like a hot mess. Um, the sectioning kind of went to shit. Um, it felt like I wanted to leave a lot around the front, which I have done, but Mm, I don't think there's much rhyme or reason to it, so, because there is black, what, or brown, okay. <laughs> I don't know what I've done. <laughs> I have no idea if this is going to turn out horrifically. I think I'm really risking it all with this. Um... I kind of just did what felt right, and maybe I shouldn't listen to my instincts. <laughs> I'm trying to just like pick out some random little strands just to, I don't know, break it up a little bit so it's not so chunky. Um, yeah, kind of nervous. Hey Siri, set mm -hmm. half hour timer. For how long? Half hour? 30 minutes, starting now. Yeah. All in, baby. Yeah, literally, like, I did it so carefully the first time. All this beautiful sectioning with foils. And today, I just, I just thought, nah. Nah, let's just not. Let's just not do that. So yeah. That's how we got here. Dunno. Intrigued. Nervous. But yeah. I will see you after 30 minutes and also after I've washed it. Let's have a vote. What do we think? Is this gonna be terrible? gonna be amazing. Actually, I was gonna pin it, but I feel like that's not even a good idea. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hmm. Oof. 
interesting. Okay, right. I will see you when as well. Okay, bye. Right. Here it is, wet, wet. I'm still none the wiser as to whether this looks good or not. I think it's going to be too harsh between the dark and the light. Or specifically the dark. But there is only one way to find out, which is to dry it. At least my hair's still healthy. That's, I guess, my main concern. <clears throat> I mean, like, I love that you can see some highlights on this. At least. It's better than nothing. <laughs> this might be a bit calm before the storm. Because it might look terrible when it's dry, so just... <laughs> hey oh my god I think I got so freaking lucky like what the hell there's definitely some patchy bits let's do A360 so you can see all the fucked up bits that I'm assuming are there <laughs> Okay, I know I sound so impressed with myself here, and I don't think it looks amazing, but I was very sure that it was going to be a complete disaster, and I'm just so happy in this because it's not horrific, so I'm not that pleased with myself, but it kind of sounds like I am. How bad is it? <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm like so happy. I think... It just looks a lot more natural and less like bright blonde. There's definitely some bad bits. Let's let's find one. Probably won't be too difficult. Well here you can like see the difference in shade between the low lights. That's banding from before, I think. Okay, well, I guarantee that there are dodgy bits. I think maybe I do get lucky in that my hair's just so thick that it kind of, like, hides all my mistakes. Um, I probably wouldn't advise doing it like this because I think I did get really lucky. Like, you should probably foil and do it carefully, which is what I did the first time. It just didn't work. So <laughs> Sometimes chaos pays off. Yeah, I'm pretty happy. I'm hopeful that this should like grow out, fade out nicely. Um, yeah, still healthy. But yeah, I would say this was a successful low lighting of my hair. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Hopefully I'll be leaving my hair alone for a little bit. So. Give me strength. Um, but yeah. Bye.